Hey, would you rather listen to this podcast from your favorite device on the go? Why not listen to this episode of Smash Talk on Spotify? Link in the description. Well, it's all dirty. People are throwing it away for a reason. Well, you not donate necessarily. That shit. Not necessarily at all. Thrift is not always... A, one man's... There's not a lot of well-known phrases that refute your it's dirty point. Sorry. That means I just win automatically. I claim victory. I'm the older brother. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Smash Talk. Today, we will be discussing each arms fighter's, um... What's the word I'm looking for, Andy? I've totally blanked here. Life We're in the ability. intro and I'm not doing well. Fan art ability. Basically, yeah. We're gonna dis discuss each arms character's, um... Nope, still gone. Tr you try. Uh, likelihood? Likelihood, that's the word, thank you. We're gonna discuss each arms fighter's likelihood of getting into Smash, because we're in June now, and we should be getting some news about the new Smash fighter who is gonna be from ARMS. Or not. Or not. Or, rather, or not, we're not potentially not gonna get some news, not. Yeah, Nintendo might just push that shit back to, uh, August. 22nd. Or December of next year. Because they can. Well... Because they have to. Oh, well, that too. I mean, Sakurai did say that progress was going well on it, but... Yeah, he said I'm... that months ago. <laughs> yeah, it gave us news a while ago. Anyway, today, we're just gonna discuss but, each... honey, you said the pizza was on its way. Yeah, I said that before the accident. <laughs> I said that before our daughter died. But today, we're just gonna be discussing each arms fighter's, uh... Of, uh, not like ability. Likelihood of getting into Smash. And obviously, Springman is out because he's an assist trophy, and bringing him to the arms fighters... Or Would open the floodgates to uh, Waluigi. Yes, and no one wants <coughs> Waluigi in this game, really. No one really does, and if you do, you're wrong. Stop lying to yourself. Talk to your father about it. <laughs> Pet your dog, maybe. Talk it's to your doctor neglected. about Runista if you're diagnosed with wanting Waluigi in Smash. Runesta. <laughs> For idiots. Andy, why are you getting your ass kicked by a goddess? I... You are a demon, have you forgotten? No. Kirby's the well... demon, that's why he, you know, survived. Huh? That's why he survived the... the uh, lightning of everything. I don't know about that much. I do. The shot. Oh god. Oh man, you knocked her out of the way of the thing I wanted to kill her with. Mostly my fist. Okay, so Springman is out because... I would like a tiara, please. Yay. Ooh, I got a little bit more. You get, Yeah, you got a bunch of hair, too, you fucking cosplayer. What does it even do? Oh, My shit. Hair? Oh, shit. Just no, kind of the remains. B you get. Or is it, uh... Uh... Hair doesn't tend to have a use. No, no, no. You, the copy ability you get from Palutena. Bugs. Kill Pac-Man. He deserves aim. it. What? It's an auto-aim. Oh, yeah, that one. That felt good. Okay. Punch her to death. Like, really hard, too. I'll use my stomach and my crown and my gun. <laughs> you use everything else you have. Nice. There we go. Ooh, I got a crown again. Here you go. Uh, Whoops. Did we both fall for that? I thought there was some uh, edge limitation on that. There is not. Get her, Andy. Get her, Andy. I will forever lose faith in you if you die to her. Oh, wow. She almost got me. Okay. How about not? Back to our discussion of likelihoods of players getting into Smash. We've got Ribbon Girl. I mean, we should already... We should probably take note of who's already spirit. We've got Ribbon Girl, Is Ninjara... Spirit? Yeah, that, that are already spirits. Ribbon Girl, Ninjara, Min Min, and I think... Uh, Twintel is the other spirit. So, I think Ribbon Girl would be a great choice, because she's not... She has multiple jumps in arms itself, and she'd be the first fighter who's not inflatable who would have multiple jumps. Or doesn't have wings. Because I count Banjo and Kazooie as having wings, that's why they get the extra jump. Because it's a bird. 
Captain the Bear. Inflatable wings. Inflatable wings. Where's Jigglypuff? I, I want to prove my point even more. Inflatable. <laughs> there we go. Piranha Plant nearly got another one. That would have been fun, actually. Wings. Yep. Inflatable or wings is is the cutoff there. She'd be the first fighter without inflatable inflatability or wings that would get an extra jump, and that'd be interesting because she gets I think she gets like five extra jumps in arms, something close to that. That'd be pretty cool to see, honestly. Just little hops, not like full on jumps. That'd be I think that would be uh, you know a good cap to her abilities because she's got extendable arms. She can hit you from almost anywhere. Um. I think she's got high uh, likelihood of getting in. What do you think? Yeah, it would make sense. It would. I think it'd be a good one. Um, whoops. Okay, yeah, that's what I wanted. I wanted to kick him real hard. Whoops. No, Andy, you weren't supposed to let that happen. I'm gonna kick a hero in the head. Man, he's really good at using those stupid things real fast. Oh man. PK, ouch. I'm here. No, oh, I wanted the flamey punch. There we go, I got it. Shit! I am the wrong way. I don't think I can turn toward him in midair. Andy, critical hit. Look out. Uh oh. That's okay, I'll lose for us. Out of here. I mean, I warned you I was gonna lose. Don't mm. expect anything else. How about you give you give your opinion on the next one? It should be Ninjara is next. Uh oh yeah, he would dodge further, right? Yeah, he would probably dodge further. His uh, dodge is a teleport. Yeah, I suppose it makes sense. But I've always kind of seen him as just a green-haired spring man. Not as fun. Yeah, that's about it. I, I think sort of what he, he looks like. I think he's got pretty low likelihood. And as we all know, looks matter. They do. <laughs> if it doesn't have breasts or huge muscles, it's not getting into Smash. Pokemon don't count. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I like how your mind went straight to Pokemon. <laughs> what else would I have to count out? Aliens? Plants? High school boys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with Turtley. Okay, so Ninjara has a no. Two thumbs down. I'm gonna go something without huge muscles, breasts, and hasn't gone to high school. <laughs> That's because it's and an animal. And not as a Pokemon. <laughs> and is not a Pokemon. <laughs> okay, what about uh, Master Mummy? I also give a no. I give a thumbs down on that one. He'd be cool. Uh, another heavy. That would be interesting, because none of the DLC fighters have been heavies yet. Oh god, I'm getting the crap kicked out of me. <clears throat> I think the only heavy in Ultimate as a uh, new heavy in Ultimate as of yet has been King K. Rule. I would agree with you. I mean, maybe the maybe Simon and Richter, but those don't really count. Kind of puny. Yeah, they're puny heavies. I punched a dog! I was punched by a dragon. I aimed the wrong way on that one. Paid for it immediately. Andy... Kick ass. Do it. I don't really know how Finish banjo it. works. What? I don't really know how banjo works. I just picked him for the joke. That's okay. Oh, yeah. I didn't mean to quote the planning meeting for that, did I? <laughs> I don't know how banjo works. I just picked him because it was funny. <laughs> Mr. Sakurai, are you sure that's the reason you want to go with? Uh, Fuck yeah, Not in interviews. <laughs> Banjo-Kazooie is a great example of a, a emblematic moment of gaming history because the dynamic duo are... Under the, the table he's got like a nervous tick where he like scratches at his leg <laughs> and it's starting to bleed. He's got one of those wooden fidget toys. Oh god, I don't know what I'm saying. Why did someone write this for me? The bear and bird have always been uh, they friendly only toward the three games, animal community, but they deserve a sequel that you can play on the Xbox. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying what? <laughs> He's so fucking appalled by the fact he has to mention Microsoft. 
Yeah. Okay, that was pretty good. Yeah, yeah, you used that to full effect. Okay, so what about Mechanica? No. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna give straight up no for that one. I was telling you about this earlier, about that supposed rumor leak thing. Yeah, that it's a little girl and a big robot and no one's gonna like it. Yeah. It'd be really disappointing if Mechanica was it, because she does not represent what ARMS was! Yeah, if anybody was, it was Springman. Yeah, well, I mean, anyone who wears a mask and uh, suddenly has arms, because that's what the lore of arms is. Exactly! It can't be Mechanica. She doesn't wear a mask to get the arms. She built a robot. And she's 13, guys! Are you witnessing this live, everybody? We officially have arms gatekeepers of a lore that's completely fake and fraudulent. Where's the arms manga? I want to read it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I hit the wrong button in midair. Wow, that worked Check really. out my arms, guys! They're just as long as all the people in the fighting arena. They're not real! Use your mask! <laughs> Andy, why are we letting the big sword high school boy kick our ass? I don't think he's in high school. Well, how old do you think he is, then? Uh, I don't know. I punched him real hard, anytime, so he's not that old. Anytime a character in a RPG Shit. or an anime confirms their age, I'm like, mm, I don't care. Could have done without that. Yeah. I'll just assume you're 20. Unless, Everybody yeah. here is 20. Unless it's above 20, then I'm like, eh, sure, alright. If it's 13, you're like, alright, well, I'm on a list now. That's why I think I'm super into Sing Yesterday for me, because it's Isn't actually... that the super musical oh, one we saw? Yeah. Or was that Carolyn Tuesday? That's Carolyn Tuesday. Okay, I'm sorry. Sing Yesterday for me is about uh, post-college people who are really sad about stuff. <laughs> <laughs> no other way to put it. Oh! <laughs> Yeah, they're trying to get jobs and stuff, and it's really fun, because it's actually about adult things that I care about, <laughs> instead of, mm, does she like me? Not a good You're example. also worried about that, because you're looking yeah. at Shantae like, mm, does she want, does she does want she me want to, to buy her? Smash? <laughs> she does. Yeah. She'll be a fun addition. So will Bandana D. Yeah, You course. hear that? Shantae and Bandana D. Shantae and Bandana D. Or the gain on the mic. No. <sighs> no, you just... I muted it, so they couldn't hear that. It's cool. Andy, kick ass! Don't let Sword High School Boy 1 and Sword High School Boy 2 kick Why yours. Why did he counter that? I could be dead now. Sweet release. <laughs> I know how to help. No, I don't. Uh, uh. Okay, what about, uh, Min Min? Uh, so ARMS held, like, an online popularity contest tournament a while ago, and Min Min won out. Min Min deserves it. Yeah, I think she Min Min is beat awesome. out Twintel. They're both great, but yeah. I like... No, no, I like them both. Uh, my Nintendo had... Friends. <laughs> <laughs> can you believe it? Turning these down to eight, because we suck at fighting them. James and Editing, can you block out what James just did? <laughs> Thank you, don't want anyone to know. <laughs> Oh shit, I'm gonna go a giant monkey. My Nintendo, you know that they had, uh, they, they, uh, quote unquote sell wallpapers, right? Yeah, yeah, they had them. One of the wallpapers they had during ARMS' release and circulation was a concept, uh, not design, just illustration of, uh, rather than an ensemble of characters and their renders, was Min Min just eating ramen at her shop. Oh yeah, that was part of the. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, it's I have it as one of my wallpapers in the cycle. It's 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 such a fun one. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh shit! We're good. But the thing is, I do believe that's the only one of a character that isn't like an ensemble cast, because all the others are like, oh, it's Springman fighting Max Brass and ah! and saving a kid with his arms and yeah. eating a slice of pizza that's really long and cheesy. Yeah. All no, the others it's are. it's just a regular character doing the regular thing at the regular job. Uh, oh boy. Yeah, which doesn't necessarily indicate like, oh, they knew that she was going to be in Smash even back then. No. no, it's just, you know, it's an interesting piece of art because it's unique to the rest of the characters. Yeah. Die, you and, fucking uh, child! That they clearly seem to like, if not favor, oh! if not favor <laughs> Min Min to some degree. They should. Min Min's great. Yeah. Okay, so I give her a thumbs up. What do you give her? Uh, yeah, sure. She'd be cool. I give... <laughs> I want... Future me, put a thumbs up next to it, yeah sure. Yeah, Google yeah sure and do the first... The first three images, put them all together. Photoshop them together into some sort of uh, horror. <laughs> what was that that Inkling just did? 
died. It's called being top tier. <laughs> I thought you could say it's called being dumb. Anyway. So Min Min is yes. What about Kid Cobra? Cobra, I'm sorry. I don't care for him. I'm saying no as well. Okay, moving on. But I guess he'd be cool in Smash, because he'd be colorful. He would. Helix. I say yes. I don't care for him. Well, okay. I, I don't care for them. That's fine. Helix is fun. I, I thought his character was kind of cool. He was my main in arms. I know we didn't play a lot of it, but I think in the time we did play it, we could have decided main characters. Main fighters. Mine was Ribbon Girl. Absolutely Ribbon Girl. <clears throat> Andy fucking owned his Ribbon Girl. It was amazing to go online, because we did use to play online games, lo and behold, and Andy would fucking wreck his Ribbon Girl. It was amazing to watch him work. Oh yeah, it was incredible. It was! The thing was, we never went outside of our ranks, so it was pretty easy to win. <laughs> that and fighting me eventually got boring, and we so we had to fight him. No, we didn't. We played for fun. Eh, uh, sure. <clears throat> God, I can't land a hit as Byla. She is so... It is... They are so slow. But they're a... They're a... A range demon? What was it called? A dickhole? No. Pain in the ass? When they were introduced in their trailer, it was a... Oh. Uh, a teacher. <laughs> I teach so I can love and hurt. The uh, pain you feel is on my lessons. <laughs> Because they have a spear and a bow and that, so they're like a range warrior. Die, you fucking master sword wielding son of a bitch! <laughs> Seriously, it's so hard to land a hit with her for some reason. It's them with so for some reason, even though I just landed a hit there. It's so weird playing on this stage, and tomorrow I'm gonna play Animal Crossing again because I do a daily. Oh, that's me falling off. Yes, it is. It's I'm you. sorry. It's me dying. No I, one I, makes me bleed my own blood. Yeah. Rip Gara. Who? Gara said that. I mean, that was one of the. That's one of the, my favorite moments in all of uh, the Naruto is the Gara shooting. bleeding. Yeah, it's Gara bleeding for the first time because he yells, "Blood! It's my blood!" Oh. And it was like, "Wow, that is some scary shit." No one yells that unless shit is about to go down. Oh, I thought it was like a. I don't know who says it, but I thought it was a movie line. No, it's just, comedy. it was just... No one makes me bleed my own blood. Probably was, but it was just... The delivery of that line was like... Oh, okay. Oh. Alright. Pausing. Gonna get a drink. <laughs> so I can spit it at the screen when whatever happens is about to happen. Oh. It wasn't that epic. Anyway. Bite and bark. Oops. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> I don't know how they would be implemented, because they seem like... Uh, an ice climber situation where one is the sorry more like a Rosalina and Luma where one is shoots. the main character and one okay, just yeah, kind of rolls work. around yeah perfect uh -oh. reliable <laughs> okay so yeah oh god flip those thumbs upside down yeah but they were down flip them back up in the case of Mechanica bite and bark don't really it seems like bite and bark are more focused on their dynamic more so than they are like look at our arms because arms is about look at our arms i like to think that like they had all these characters and then down at the bottom they're like oh shit we forgot this one <laughs> put it in yeah not because <coughs> of the dlc ones that they literally forgot to include more like with bark bite and bark i mean I, I feel like they were probably the last ones they implemented not max brass We're back. I'm good. Future me. Edit that out. <clears throat> James and editing, can you fill in that gap with some weird stock footage? Thank you. I mean, you're welcome. I don't know. Punch the dragon, dinosaur, and punch the witch lady. That was fun. Oh, for some reason I thought you were a bayonetta. Whoa. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that to the computers where I win every time. Gonna keep punching! Whoops. Sorry, Andy. There we go. That felt real good. Oh, that was a bad one. Okay, next we've got Twintel. I think hell to the yes. Yep. That'd be so cool. That'd be wonderful. That would be... That would just be great. <clears throat> I think I punched her while she was coming down with her down air. Twintel's ability is, uh, gliding, yeah? I believe so. Yeah. That'd be fun. Well, that makes sense. 
Because we have two gliders in Peach and Daisy, I think. Plus, but I think she would slap. Like, she would actually try what? and slap you. Oh. Like, that would be her batter when she grabs you. She grabs you with her hair, and then she just slaps you. Oh, yeah. Because she uses her hair as her fighting, and then she's got her arms crossed the whole time. Yeah. Because she so, hasn't unleashed oh, her full power. She'd basically be Mewtwo. Where yeah! Where he levitates and just lets his mind do the work. That'd be so cool! Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, I'm on that. Put another thumb on my hand so I can have two thumbs up. Don't. Thank you, me. <laughs> Next, we have the DLC characters they added later on. Max Brass. I feel like if they're not going to put in Springman, which they can't, Max Brass would be the next, the closest thing to a Springman type character because he's basically just a stronger, heavier Springman. Okay. I feel like he'd be the next one to get in. <clears throat> that, he was kind of an integral part to the beginning, middle, and end of the game. <clears throat> Being that you fought him at the end of the campaign, campaign. mode every single time. He was the one until Dr. Coil showed up. I stomped on a robot. I kicked him. He's just catching the end of all my attacks. Oh god. Hey Greninja, I fucking hate you! Tell he's us how me, you really feel. He's hit me with the same attack like six times in a row. I'm gonna stab him with my tail. There we go. That felt good. And stop. Andy, don't fall to the robot. Good job. E. Stab twice and then throw him away. Just like you do with the robot. That felt good. No, I don't want to die. Um, I don't know how I just flew that high. <clears throat> he... Okay. Eh. Eh. Andy, get him. Finish him. He's not dying. Oh... Flipping him over did nothing. Yeah, it seemed to make him stronger. Man, I cannot hit him. There we go. Time to switch up my strategy and let Andy finish it. <coughs> Andy, finish the fight for me. Next we've got... Now back to our favorite show. Andy, you do it. <laughs> Lola Pop. She'd be fun, I think. I think she'd be a good character to have in there. I don't think she'd win out other characters, but I feel like she'd be she'd be a good one to add. She inflates, right? Yes. Let's keep her away from the internet. <laughs> Too late. Okay. <clears throat> Next we've got Missango. He's got like different masks and a thing that flies around him or something. I don't know what his abilities are. So another Rosalina and Luma? Uh kind of. I think okay. it's more like a sprite kind of thing. Where if uh, Link had Navi, it would just fly around him. Helping him? Maybe? If Crash was added, Crash Bandicoot, do you think that wooden mask thing would fl would help him? Probably. Fly around? Huh. We'd have to see. <coughs> I, I'm, I'm, because I, we don't know about Mesango, he's so unmemorable, I don't think, I don't think he'll get in. I don't know enough about him to say one way or the other. Exactly. What about, uh... Next up is Springtron. What do you think? How the heck did I this mean... happen? <laughs> Look at all these Fire Emblem Sword guys. <laughs> oh, that's what you mean. I thought you meant with Springtron. Uh... That'd be funny. I think that'd be good, because you can't have Springman. What's the next best thing? Oh. Fucking robot! Yeah. I was going to say, narratively speaking, Max Brass and uh, Ribbon Girl would make sense. Because those, because out, uh, sorry, out of the whole cast of arms, the three most narratively important ones: <laughs> Ribbon Girl, Spring Man, and Max Brass. Because they're the ones that are in the promotional materials and box art, and featured most heavily in the campaigns, and what sort. 
Okay. The most popular one, evident. <coughs> the most popular ones, evidently, are Twin Tail and Min Min. Of course. And uh, if you want Spring Man at this point as a fighter in Smash, you could just have Spring Trunk, because exactly. that would that would basically just be an Echo. Yeah, it would. And uh, it'd be funny. <laughs> it would be pretty. It funny. would be hilarious as well. If uh, Springtron got added into Smash before Waluigi, <laughs> oh my God! I mean, they added pe uh, Piranha Plant no! as well as before Isaac. I mean, that's sad, but still, I understand. You saved him. That was that was stupid. I know, but uh, let me kill him with the magic. It didn't work with a magic. I don't know what that did. That's what it did. Boom. I missed! I missed totally! Hatchet man! Damn it. What about. Oh. God. I died. <laughs> Good luck, Andy. All I wanted to do was have fun, and the game said no. Okay, moving on, we've got the final character added two arms uh. Dr. Coil. And the crowd goes wild. I don't know enough. <clears throat> know enough about her. She's basically Farah from Overwatch. Oh, okay. Yeah, she That's flies, good. and she can punch you. That'd be cool. And she's the reason that uh, Springtron exists. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. She's evil. Okay. Um. I think she'd be fun. I think she'd be a good character to have. I don't think she'd be the top choice. It'd be kind of funny if she got added in. Before as, Waluigi. Well, as uh, a DLC character in ARMS and a DLC character in Smash. <laughs> Just sort of... Double DLC that shit? Yeah. <sighs> yeah, she's the main antagonist of the game. What? Of of ARMS, yeah. Even though what? she was added way, way after. The game released without a main antagonist? Yeah. And stayed that way for like a year? Yeah. Oh yeah, games are releasing complete. No arms and, problem. Arms and Mario Tennis Aces don't. Splatoon <laughs> Animal Crossing! Splatoon never did. Sorry, there's something... <coughs> gigantic. <coughs> lodged in my throat. Why?! <laughs> Sorry, I, I got a little bit of it too. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to think of what to say instead of gigantic. Didn't quite... I... <laughs> Died! That's okay, Andy. You were distracted by smashing. I was stuck between saying... Oh, shit! An 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 sorry, an inadequate successor and a far superior predecessor. And my brain just went... Giant! Gigantic! <laughs> it, went after, it went after a big word instead of multiple big words. It trimmed it down for you. made it more simple for me. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Andy. So nice of your brain to do that to me. Will you die, you whippy bastard? <clears throat> I like Peach. I don't want her to die. Ow. Oh, wait. No, that didn't hurt. Wait, no, this might. It did. Because dead. Andy, did you know I died as well? I saw a little bit. Okay, you should. I'm making you aware that this is our last life both ways. And they have lost neither life yet. <coughs> there we go. That felt good. And so did that. Get him, Andy. I tried saving you. It, I don't know if it worked or helped or did anything. <coughs> oh, God, so much fire. Oh, okay. That's not good. That's worse. Did Majora's Mask have a boomerang? <clears throat> I think it did. Oh. Oh, God, no! Well, that didn't work. <clears throat> so, to... Uh, just a quick review. We said Spring Man can't happen, because that opens the floodgates for Waluigi, and nobody wants that ever in a million years. Ribbon Girl, we said yes, absolutely. Ninjara, we said no. Well, uh, I, I don't think we said no, just kind of... Okay. Yeah, we'll reluctantly accept like we did with Terry. <clears throat> this will be our last one. I'm gonna go with uh, my knee. I'm gonna go with knee four. Uh, we said Master Mummy would be cool because it's another heavy character, but it's not really preferred. Good idea. And Mechanica, we said please don't, don't, yeah. don't do me like this, please. 
Min Min, we said yes. Popularity contest says yes. James and Andy say yes. The world says yes. Just give it to us so we can move on and play our Min Min. I like how you kicked him away right into my all my, all my punches. Oh god, Andy, no. Stop it. <coughs> that felt good. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. <laughs> Did we both just use the same move on him? I don't think so. Uh oh. Man, Mega Man is so annoying to fight. With your fists? Yep, exactly. I think Dr. Wily's been doing that same treatment for years. God, he's annoying! <laughs> Why won't he just die? Uh, I just need to go to the pharmacy. Get some Motrin for my headache. Uh, uh -oh. Fighting him gives me such a headache. And an arm ache. Wait, am I an alien? So many aches. Oh. Were you just meteor switch? Yes. Oh, I that felt good. <coughs> Uh-oh. Oh no! Right off the edge. Got him. Hey, villager, I want to throw you. And I did. Oh, that was okay. Punch him. Punch him. Get him, Andy. Okay, this isn't going well. Oh, I wanted to do that. I thought that was me doing that the whole time. There we go. Anyway. Uh, Min Min, we said yes. Kid Cobra, we said reluctantly. Helix, we said sure, why not. Bite and Bark, we said yeah would work, even though we were trying to prove that it wouldn't. Uh, Twin Tail, we said, yeah. Max Brass, we said, sure. Lola Pop, we said, okay. Yeah, okay. Miss Ango, we said, probably not. Springtron, we said, that'd be hilarious. Just do it for the joke, Nintendo. And Dr. Quail, we said, passably. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Who do you guys think We'll get into Smash. Who do you think is the is the arms fighter that will get in? <clears throat> also, who do you th what uh, tales of protagonists do you think will get in? What? I'm not saying one's gonna get in. I'm just saying which one do you think would be the most likely to get in? I'm thinking either Yuri or, or Lloyd, just because I feel like that's gonna be what happens. Supposedly, Yuri's the most popular protagonist of Tales of. Even though he's a fucking murderer, and Yes, got James, away with because it. he's a complicated character. No, he's not. He's an asshole that got away with it. I still don't have that one. That was in the shop a moment when we started. You should have said something. I did not know. It had the it. word new on it. It did not. It was fully present in there. It was not. It was the biggest icon on the screen. You are completely wrong. You can go back through... James in editing, go back through the footage. Tell me I'm wrong. James in editing, slap Andy for me. Thank you. Here, let me just... Ah! Thank you. That's very helpful, Andy. I'm really glad you thought of that. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Presents. <laughs> I mean, I would love presents, but you're not going to give me any Nintendo, are you? Unless you put Bandana D and Shantae in Smash. Those would be presents, and Jeez. I would accept them. I've never seen someone so needy. I'm not needy, I just know what that's I like. That's a lie. I've seen one. a lot of needier people. Yeah, you have. You went to college. Art college. Uh, <laughs> I've never seen someone so in need of a punchline. <laughs> hey, I found one. Art College. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining in for this episode of Smash Talk. It was a lot of fun to talk about which ARMS characters we think will get in. I'm I'm really hanging my hat on either Max Brass or uh, Ribbon Girl. You, Which two do you think will get in, Andy? Let's do Min Min or Twin Tell, because I'm a bandwagoner. He is, majorly. Thank you guys so much for joining in. See you all next time. Stay safe, stay healthy. Thank you for joining us. This was a lot of fun, and we like doing this. Smash is great. I didn't even know when I made that. I even didn't. I didn't even spell it right. I didn't even know. <laughs> I don't. All right. Bye, everybody. <laughs>